Hey there YouTube, Laytar Awesome here, welcome back to Pokemon Leaf Green Version. In the last part, we took out the three legendary birds and got here to the Viridian City Pokemon Gym. This guy who says the leader has returned. And you also say the leader has returned. The leader is a question mark. He's just that awesome. Anyway, in this part, we're going to be taking down this place. Yeah. And we're going to roast it. And then eat it. In the proper order. Uh-huh. You heard what I said. Yeah. Keep on slashing. Uh-oh. Whew. Okay. <laughs> I was actually worried about that for a second. Um... Puffball, get up front. No, not you. You. Thank you. You. Fight me. Karate is the ultimate form of martial arts? Whoa! What? Right, you have guts that boost your power when you're burned. Oh well. Radiant Gym was closed for a long time. Yada, yada, yada. Yabba, dabba, doo. Yay. Um, yeah, I don't really have anything interesting to say in this part. I don't know why. I just, I just don't. Maybe I'm tired. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I mean, I am tired. I know that. And I haven't slept well in days. But I never sleep well, so who cares? Anyway, um, went off and healed real quick, and then... I <laughs> just wanted to go in a circle, apparently. Heh, you must be running out of steam by now. Actually, I just went and healed myself, so nope, I'm not running out of steam at all. I am, in fact, quite steam-filled. It'll make sense later. Ow! Ow! You poop! What? You're getting rock smashed in the face. Bye, Eradicate! What up? More rock smashing. In the face. Bye, Eradicate. Never mind that plan. It was a bad plan. Ow. <sighs> okay. You ran out of gas. See? See? You ran, you ran out of the gas. Because I keep healing. <laughs> Wait. Because I keep healing. I think I didn't get that in before, I mean, I think the, I, the, the I, I'm not even going to try to complete that thought. It was lost in the haze of, well, killing. <laughs> Darn it! Why does Bucky keep going up against these rock types who, even though he has Brick Break now, he can't really fight? Uh, do you know the identity of our gym leader? No. I'll keep it secret. The truly talented win with style. The truly talented win with Sand Slash named Fluffums. That is all I have to say on this matter. And ow! More burn. You know what? You know what? It's Chiding Sweet Time. Never mind. <sighs> it was almost a sweet time, but then Rhyhorn. And why you little Iota with one HP, Fluffums the epic fainting. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll heal on screen. Why not? Anyway, um, something I feel I want to mention, and I may not have mentioned before, in the original red-blue version, there was actually an item in this gym. Yeah. You're the Karate King? I thought that other dude was the Karate King. He had, like, a dojo and stuff. He seemed more kingy than you, random guy. Takashi. I don't even need to go heal. You know what? I'm not going to go heal. 
Because I don't need to. Um, instead, I'm just gonna jump right in for a final rematch. Fwahaha! Welcome to Hideout! It be him that till I bring Team Rocket back. Toss and Giovanni is struggling with his fancy words. But you find me now. Let's do this. This time, Tarzan no hold back. Once more, you fight Tarzan, Giovanni, greatest trainer ever! I love this theme, by the way. Just just wanted to point that out. Anyway, uh, Giovanni here is going to start out with a Rhyhorn, and I thought it was going to be a Doug Trio. Um, but, whatever. <laughs> Another Rhyhorn! That's his highest level, and I don't know why this isn't a Rhydon. It really should be. Um, anyway, Nita Queen is up next. I I'm just gonna rip through this guy. Um, this Giovanni is not hard. Uh, his levels are kind of high-ish. Um, wow, oh, Chenang, you did not do very well there, did you? Um, but honestly, it's nothing that you can't handle. Um, like, seriously, he's, he's, his levels seem kind of up there, but, you know, <laughs> spam surf, you'll be fine. Like, that was a truly intense fight. Not really. Just not really. Um, and we get Earthquake that he used at the gym long ago. But I'm going to leave you there forever because I'm not saying goodbye to you. And you're now trapped in your gym so that the police can come and collect you at their leisure. Because you're an international criminal. At least a national criminal. I don't know about international, actually. So, ooh, ooh, I can cut this down. And he can teach you Dream Eater. I don't know if I ever pointed that out before. But moving right along, because this is going to be a longer part, we have... Rival. Hobbs. What, Calvin? What a surprise to see you here. So you're going to the Pokemon League? Got all the badges? Yeah. He's going to whip me. That other guy threatened to whip me. What is it with people and whipping me? Is it like fun? I don't, I don't, I don't understand. You know what? You know what? You're really a pain today, Rival. Just... Just annoying all around. Um, Puffball, get in there. And roast your food before you eat it. Ha 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 ha! Gah! Gyarados. Um. Spore? And then. Bullet Seed? No, not Bullet Seed. Um. You know what? Just overwhelm it with physical moves! Physical moves. <laughs> Not physical moves. Uh, ow! Actually, ow! Huh! <laughs> um, it's not expecting that. Uh, nice and cute. I can roast it alive. Yes. Barney, get in. Uh, just slash it until it either wakes up or dies. It did both on the same turn! Convenient! Um... Now his Alakazam... Quick eye meant to bite. Oops. Um, dude had to get in there. Save me. Oh, what did he use? I didn't even look. Ah, oh, well! That's the rival. Um, he's actually kind of a challenge, so definitely heal up before you fight him. Um, especially since Giovanni can hurt you. Um, I mean, I think he hurt me. Yeah, he, yeah, he did some damage to me. Um, actually, 47s. That is not bad. Not bad at all for this point. Um, as long as you fight all the trainers, your levels should be okay. Uh, 
I'm not quite ready to take on the Elite Four, but should be fine for Victory Road, right? Right? I mean, it shouldn't be that tough. It's actually pretty tough. Um, <laughs> it, it'll actually be a little bit tougher than the Fire Red Omega version of Victory Road, I think. Um, maybe not. No, no, there were, there were a couple trainers in there that scared the living daylights out of me. Because they were terrifying. And we're now through the badge check gates. Um, I guess I'll start on Victory Road. I'll get through part of it, at least. I guess. Um, oh man, I'm gonna need more super repels, aren't I? Probably. Um, probably. But. Whatever. Um. <laughs> Oh, I was not expecting that high of a level for some reason. Yikes. Um, you wonder if I'm good enough for you? I wonder if you're good enough for me. Can you keep me entertained? Evidently. <laughs> um, ow! That would be that screech plus confusion plus super high attack kicking in. Oh, this is going to be annoying, isn't it? Yep, this place is going to annoy me. What? Two crits in a row and one of them flinched? Oh, that's just plain mean. That's, that's just mean. Man, like... Not cool. Um, not, not at all cool. Hold on. Okay, I'm back. I actually did a couple things off screen. I um went and healed first of all. Then I stocked up on some super repels, sold a bunch of items, and actually uh, got the move deleter to delete Flash from um from Barney. Yeah, that's his name. Um. Just because I wasn't using it, and I, I, I mean, I wouldn't need it again, and he could use a better move, so whenever he's going to learn it, um, he's now capable of doing so. So, this guy here, um, I said in Fire and Omega that he's kind of like the benchmark of if you're ready to take on this place, that stands true. Um, he's got the, well, the starters. <laughs> um in this game. Um, would you- Oh, come on! With the miss, and then the sleep, and that come. What?! You little poop! Just- You're just a poop. That's all you are. <sighs> no, I'm not gonna switch, because rock slide. Ay. Um... <laughs> I can see you all better than I. Do I have... Yeah, I've got a room 5. You know what? <laughs> what? I also have some super potions. I don't care. I just don't care. <laughs> that was bogus. He should not have gotten KO'd there. Like at all. Um. So, yeah, I just did a couple little things. Uh, basically just got money and items. Well... Super repels. Actually, that's all I bought. Um, this here is Victory Road. You don't say. I never would have. Oh, come on! I mean, I lived through the stupid attack, and then. Uh, get KO'd by a miss. Ah. Uh, you know what? I'm using revives again because I don't feel like going back to the start of this place because it's really annoying. Um, it, it just is. Yes, I wish to challenge the Elite Four. How did you know? Is it because I'm here? The place that leads to just them and nothing else? <laughs> um, didn't get in there. Chandler. And kill it. Kill it with leaks. 
<laughs> I don't know. Um, item. Give me. You. Fight me. Come on, I'll whip it. Why do people keep saying they're going to whip me? It's quite disturbing. Like, why does everyone in this game want to whip me all of a sudden? I don't understand. And ow. Ow. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> you only have three moves. Ah, <laughs> uh, that looks kind of funny. But, whatever. Um, you know what? Chandler, just stay KO'd for a little bit. Because, I don't, I don't care. I just don't care. <laughs> um, bullet seed it. Because, why not? Ah. Uh, uh, boy, howdy. What? You just are you kidding me? I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, yeah, I'm getting really annoyed by this. Uh, there's this, um, which we call Victory Road is actually probably the most annoying of them, um, just because there's nowhere to go heal. Um, that isn't really far away, and then when you come back, the whole boulder puzzles reset, and you have to redo everything, and it's just, it's just annoying. Um, just flat out a pain. Um, they fix this in later, um, games by, you know, putting convenient healing places and not having, uh, boulder puzzles that you have to do again and again. So, oh, come on! <sighs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. Art and uh, we got a spikes up and Okay, he missed whatever that was. I don't know. Hey. This is an annoying fight. All of these fights are annoying. <laughs> Yes, it was me that beat Giovanni of Team Rocket. How did you know that? And... You know what? You're not up in the lane next. I'm not going to use an item. I don't care. Um... Going over here now. Picking up Overheat. Because I might want it, I guess. Not really, but... Ah, uh, you never know. Now, you. Fight me. You get through here, you can go meet the Elite Four. You don't say. Um. A Lapras? That's. Actually, kind of scary. Um. <laughs> we would use Paris Song, so now we would die in two turns if I kept Bucky in because I was stupid. Yeah, Paris Song is like the most avoidable thing ever. Unless you're down to one Pokemon. Then. It's bad. <laughs> um, you can actually beat Elite Four members and stuff like that by just getting them down to their last. If you don't really have a way to beat it, Parasong, three turns, they faint. So you just gotta, like, spam items until they do. <laughs> um, and as long as you have a couple Pokemon left, you'll, you'll be fine. Anyway, trainers seek, live to seek stronger opponents, apparently. So, yeah. And so, why? <sighs> You're going to be annoying, aren't you? Aren't you? Are you? I'm having a tough time telling right now. Ah, yeah. Yeah, you're gonna be annoying. Real annoying. <laughs> a chancy. Ooh. Um. <laughs> quick attack. Quick attack. Die. <laughs> ah, that was fun. That was, that was fun for me. Yes. Anytime I can beat these trainers, it's fun. Uh, I'll show you just how good you are. Not. Oh, that was a sick burn. Random cool trainer. Who's now getting frozen in the face. 
Uh, Paris. Ooh, I'm still gonna freeze it in the face. A parasect. That I'm going to burn. <laughs> Because it could be so annoying with status conditions. You're furious. I'm... True with that. Only the Chosen can pass here. Ugh. Ow. Ow. Oy vey. <laughs> this guy... This guy's a... Ah! Yes! Way to go, Fluffums! Living and stuff. <laughs> Oi! Um, I'm gonna have to go through this entire place again, aren't I? Because I'm all banged up and such. Uh, whoops. Sorry about that. Ah! What? Did, there we go. Uh, whoa! You have a Blastoise? I do not remember that. Fly. Ow! <gasps> okay. Ooh. Um. Wait. There's only one more trainer in here. I believe in you. <laughs> because I don't want to go through this whole place again. They're the last trainers. So just. Just. Don't die. We're trying to become champions together. You're going to have Nidda King and Nidda Queen. So surf and then roast it if it would have lived. Okay. We can do this. Okay, we did it. Oh, thank you. Um. You're not a trainer. You teach double edge, but I still don't have anybody with rocket. And I'm out! I'm out! I'm alive! I thought there was an item here for some reason. There is not. There is a berry over here, though. Then... Go this way, and... It's over! Finally through Victory Road! Um... Actually, I think I did quite a lot in this episode. Because that is going to do it for this part. Um... Clearly. But yeah, in this part, we... I think we took down Giovanni, our rival, and Victory Road all in one episode, which is some sort of record, I think. So, <laughs> um, I hope you guys enjoyed this part, and I will see you next time when we take on the Elite Four. Not all of them in one video. Maybe all of them in one video. I might decide to do that. I'm going to grind a little, get my guys to 50. That's the level I recommend. You be at least level 50 before this Elite Four. Um, they go up to 63, and I love a challenge. So, uh, anyway, I'll see you guys next time for the Elite Four.